What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here, and today I am very happy, ecstatic, literally everything else in between right now because Activision has officially came out themselves and said that Call of Duty Modern Warfare will not feature loot boxes or supply drops or anything like that whatsoever. And this is absolutely huge because for the past five years now, honestly, I think loot boxes and heavy microtransactions are the reason why Call of Duty hasn't been as successful as it was planned out to be with a three-year developing cycle so this is very very huge and instead players are now going to be able to buy a battle pass which essentially sounds like it's kind of similar to the um, black ops pass in a way um, but if anything i think from what it sounds like it's more like the fortnite battle pass and also we can earn cod points by leveling up in these battle pass tiers so that's also a very very big change up right now um, because in the past couple of years the only way to earn cod points is of course by spending your own hard-earned money on them but now by playing the game you can earn cod points and of course all the items that are available in the battle pass very very huge stuff here guys now there are going to be two versions of the battle pass one is going to be free for all players and then the other is going to be a premium stream and that premium stream has not yet come out yet and it's going to come out a little bit later in 2019 just not on release day so um more information about that is going to be coming out very very soon here but yeah you can earn cod points and um, everything else by just playing the game so uh, they do go into a little bit more details on how the battle pass is going to work though and they say that we're introducing a new battle pass system not a loot box system all functional content that has an impact on the game balance such as base weapons and attachments can be unlocked simply by playing the game the new battle pass system will allow players to see the content that they are earning or buying battle passes will launch time to new post-launch live season so you can unlock cool new modern warfare themed content that matches each season with the new battle pass system players will be able to earn cod points by playing the game there will be both a free stream and a premium stream of content in the battle pass system in modern warfare new base weapons will be earned through gameplay simply by playing modern warfare functional attachments for base weapons can be unlocked through gameplay as well just like like the game's beta and finally the battle pass and the in-game store will feature a variety of cosmetic content that does not impact the game balance at all so like i said very very huge stuff here very monumental stuff here in the cod scene and if i'm going to be honest i think the reason why activision decided to um pull through with this decision is because for one you know the main complaint for years now is that call of duty has been heavily plagued by micros it's uh putting this bad stain this bad image on call of duty and i mean if it were to be headed down the same path honestly i don't think cod would have lasted for maybe another two more years if that um so they are changing up their um, model here for in-game content plus also i think with the current legislators pushing to ban loot boxes in video games i think activision just does not want to take a chance with that kind of stuff so they're completely changing up their model from now on and until the very near future so very very huge stuff here guys like i said and I am very, very ecstatic to hear this. Now, I think we all do got to give credit for Activision for actually listening to the fans because I feel like for a really, really long time now, Activision just really wasn't coherent with the main complaint for Call of Duty fans. Like, for example, with Black Ops 4, like, everybody kept complaining and complaining that the black market and the reserve system was just so, so unfair to the consumer. And now I think all that backlash and everything that uh, the fans have been leaving to Activision they're finally listening to us and Activision like I said just a huge round of applause to you guys thank you all so so much for listening and honestly Modern Warfare is shaping up to be a very very good year like it just seems like the developers and um, the publishing studios Activision they're actually paying attention to the stuff that COD fans have been wanting for many many years now I'm not just talking within the past five years but literally for decades now so Modern Warfare is looking up to be like, honestly, it potentially could be the best Call of Duty to date. I know I say that um, kind of every year here, here and there, yeah, but like with Black Ops 4, I really did have that intentions going into the game because it, it sounded flawless. There were no supply drops, but then we saw later on how that decided to change up, and I really, really hope and pray that Modern Warfare does not have that change up because this model right now honestly sounds so flawless, um, but of course things can change like we have seen in the 
past before, but cross your fingers that it doesn't. But like with Modern Warfare, we got crossplay. There's no season pass. The maps are free. There's even more free content. No weapon variants that have stat changing abilities. Um, and then of course now we know that loot boxes are not going to be in the game. So Modern Warfare is shaping up to be a very very good COD. It's going to be looking like a very good year for us fans. So please tell me your guys thoughts about this down below in the comments and also leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy. And thanks so much for watching. Love y'all so so much again. Very very excited to hear this news. And yeah, hopefully you guys are as well. Again, please send me your thoughts. Thanks for watching. Till next time, I'll see you guys later.